What's up everybody, welcome to a new video and today we will take a quick look on Menta because last time I did a video about this uh, coin, we had here a pretty crazy pump. So in this video I want to tell you about another trading opportunity that I'm currently watching here and if certain conditions are met I will be thinking here about opening a trading position. So yeah, if you are interested about the exact trade, definitely watch this video till the end. But before that I would like to ask you if you like my videos and you like my analysis i will be really happy if you hit that like and subscribe button and also if you type some comment under your video because it will simply help the algorithm to reach out my channel to a new people so yeah thank you guys for doing that and enjoy today's analysis but before that i would like to invite you to my discord trading group where i am sharing everyday crypto analysis on bitcoin and other altcoins that i'm currently watching so if you want to copy my exact trades or if you want to just follow my analysis you can join to this group and link to join is in the description or in the comments let's start today on the one hour chart right now we are forming here this rising wedge which is a bearish setup but still this can give us a few opportunities uh, to open here a long trade the first possible long scenario will be valid in case of breakout and support confirmation of this resistance of this rising wedge so the exact trade can look for example like this uh, if there will be that support confirmation we will get into a price discovery phase because we will be above the above the current all-time high so for the price it shouldn't be that big of a deal to do a bigger moves and my main take profit target for this trade will be around five dollar mark so if you will put the stop loss for example under this uh, under this previous loss which should give you a pretty safe stop loss and the last take profit target let's say under that uh, five dollar mark then it will give you a risk reward ratio like 8.69 which is in my opinion pretty good and if you will take multiple take profit targets then the risk reward ratio will be let's say around six uh, which is yep in my opinion a pretty pretty decent trade setup the other long scenario that i'm currently watching on the one hour chart will be valid in case of uh, testing fake out and then support confirmation of this support of this rising wedge so i need uh, to see something like this stop loss in that case i want to put under the load that we will create during during the fake out so let's say approximately three percent stop loss something like that and the last take profit target can remain the same because i think that in the long run the five dollar mark is here like really really probable and in this case you are having your risk reward ratio like 18 but of course it will depend on how big the fake out will eventually be but let's now count with that 18 risk reward ratio but in this case definitely some of the profits take under this resistance of this rising wedge and then take some of the profits for example here here and here which in the end will give you a risk reward ratio at least around 10 but i think it will be more around like 12 13 something like that which is in my opinion absolutely amazing so yeah definitely keep an eye on this setup because i think that with the fake out this is the best long scenario that you can currently get on this coin on the other hand, if you think that this coin is gonna drop and you want to create here a short trade, I am also watching here two interesting setups. The first one will be valid in case of breakout, fakeout and resistance confirmation under this resistance of this rising wedge because still this is like a bearish setup. This short trade can look uh, can look exactly like this. So uh, stop loss you need to put above the high that we will create during the fakeout and the last take profit targets, well this is pretty hard to say but uh, me personally i would put it above uh, this like previous lows because this will be really really important support so above this strong low which is on the level 2.10 which will give you risk reward ratio 9 0.2 which is not bad but again some of the profits take above this support of this rising wedge then above this previous lows then above this previous lows and then yeah save some back to the last take profit target so in the end the risk reward ratio will be let's say around six six and a half something like that which is still really good and the other short scenario will be of course valid in case of breakdown and resistance confirmation of this of this uh, rising wedge because as i said this is a bearish setup so the main uh 
set up according to technical analysis will be to wait for exactly this again stop loss uh, you can put somewhere somewhere back to the somewhere back to this rising wedge this is really depends on the risk reward ratio that you want to have because there is like no exact target or exact high that you want to use for your for your stop loss and the, and the stop loss can again remain the same so in this case you have risk reward ratio like 6.6 6.7 something like that uh, which is uh, which is like not bad but if you will take for example some of the profits above the slows then above this slows and then you will save some back to the elastic profit target then the risk reward ratio will be around four and a half something like that which is not bad but in my opinion the long scenarios that i told you about in this video are much better so me personally i will be only speculating here for that long trade but of course there are like certain conditions that need to be met that i talked about in this video and if the conditions are not met then i won't be opening any trading position here okay guys if you want to copy my exact trades or if you want to just follow my analysis you can join my discord trading group where i am sharing the analysis every single day and link to join is in the description or in the comments but yeah this will be all for me for today thanks again for watching this video and i will see you in the next one see ya